First on our list happens to be one of the largest and most expensive vehicles on this list, and also happens to be the largest Jeep you can buy, and it just returned to the market in 2021 after being retired for around three decades. What Jeep are we talking about? None other than the iconic Jeep Wagoneer. The Wagoneer is a full-size SUV that offers seating for up to eight people and offers front row passengers headroom of 41.3 inches, while the front legroom comes in at 40.9 inches. Beyond generous space, the Wagoneer's interior is just gorgeous, while the premium model, the Grand Wagoneer, can only be described as luxurious. As for power, the Wagoneer does not disappoint. The standard engine is a 397 horsepower, 5.7 liter Hemi V8 that is paired with an 8-speed automatic transmission. If somehow that's not enough power for you, higher-end models come with a monster 471 horsepower, 6.4 liter Hemi V8. All this power results in class-leading towing capacity of up to 10,000 pounds when properly equipped. As with all good things in life, there's a trade-off for all this power. And that's a hit to fuel economy, which ranges between as little as 13 miles per gallon in the city and as much as 22 miles per gallon on the highway, depending on configuration. Prices start at $69,440 and can easily exceed $100,000 fully equipped. Looking for an SUV that is a tad bit more affordable but still great for tall people? Well, the next vehicle on our list comes in at under half the price of the Wagoneer, but packs a lot of punch. First, however, before we unveil this champ, let's briefly talk about what this video is all about. Now, tall people are no different than anyone else. They want to drive in comfort and they love SUVs. But obviously, some SUVs are going to be better suited for the needs of a tall person than others. So in this video, we're going to go through eight of the best SUVs for tall people in no particular order. All right, let's move on to the second SUV on the list, the Subaru Ascent. Now, you would generally think that the larger the SUV, the more headroom and legroom the vehicle would offer. Well, that's not always the case, as the Ascent offers more headroom and legroom than some larger SUVs. This three-row mid-size crossover SUV can seat seven or eight adults, depending on configuration, and despite being able to seat that many people, it still provides a generous 41.3 inches of headroom and 42.2 inches of legroom in the front row. That's right, that's more than the much larger Jeep Wagoneer that we just highlighted. Now, with this being a Subaru, the Ascent comes standard with all-wheel drive, as do nearly all Subarus. In addition, the Ascent offers 8.7 inches of ground clearance for light off-roading and is rated up to 5,000 pounds in towing capacity. The ride is comfortable despite handling like a small SUV and can be equipped with a captain's chair in the second row. The Ascent received the highest possible safety rating of Top Safety Pick Plus in 2021 from the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety and is loaded with a variety of advanced safety technologies. Fuel economy is not a major selling point, but it is reasonable at between 21 and 27 miles per gallon. At a starting price of $32,295, the Subaru Ascent clearly delivers a lot for the money and should be considered by tall SUV buyers. The Jeep Wagoneer isn't the only legacy nameplate to return in 2021, as Ford also returned a beloved nameplate back into its lineup. The Ford Bronco Sport is a compact two-row SUV that is based on the same platform as the Ford Escape and offers a very attractive, muscular look and corresponding superior off-road capabilities. The Bronco Sport seats five and is genuinely one of the most affordable SUVs on the market for tall people, as it offers 41.5 inches of front headroom as well as an impressive 42.4 inches of legroom. This generous space in the front does not extend to the back row, however, as even some average height adults may find it less than ideal. Much like the Ascent, all-wheel drive is standard, as is a turbocharged 181-horsepower EcoBoost three-cylinder engine that can be upgraded to a 250-horsepower Turbo 4 engine. Towing capacity comes in at 2,200 when properly equipped, and fuel economy ranges from 21 miles per gallon to 28 miles per gallon, depending on configuration. Ford offers four models to choose from, ranging from the base model, Big Bend, Outer Banks, and Badlands model, and prices start at $27,415 for the base model and push $40,000 fully equipped. For those of you that love Fords but are looking for something bigger than a compact SUV, the next vehicle on our list may be just the ticket. The full-size three-row Ford Expedition is just huge and can seat up to eight people who will enjoy around 42 inches of headroom. As for legroom, the vertically gifted will enjoy a phenomenal 44 inches in the first row, 
while those in the second row will be nearly as comfortable with 42 inches of legroom. Predictably, the third row is a different ballgame and only provides 36 inches. The interior is high-end, but does feature some hard plastic surfaces. Depending on trim level, the Expedition comes with a twin turbocharged V6 engine that offers between 375 horsepower and 400 horsepower. Rear-wheel drive is standard, but four-wheel drive is available as an upgrade. With all this size and power, you'd think fuel economy would be dismal. Well, fortunately, that's not the case, as the Expedition sees a reasonable fuel economy for its size of between 17 and 23 miles per gallon, depending on configuration. Prices start at $50,595. Maybe a full-size SUV or a starting price of over $50,000 is just too much for you. No problem, as the next SUV on our list may just be the perfect fit, as it isn't too big or too expensive, but offers plenty of space. The Nissan Pathfinder is a three-row mid-size SUV that was completely redesigned for the 2022 model year. This redesign was, to say the least, badly needed and long overdue, as the previous design was from 2013 and simply looked boring. Well, the new Pathfinder has, to a certain extent, done a full circle and has embraced the off-road look of the original Pathfinder. As for how well-suited the Pathfinder is for tall people, front headroom comes in at 42.3 inches and legroom at 44.3 inches. The second row also offers plenty of headroom and legroom, while the third row, understandably, is better suited for smaller adults or children. As for the drivetrain, the Pathfinder comes with a sufficiently powerful standard 3.5 liter 284 horsepower V6 engine, along with a new 9-speed automatic transmission. Front wheel drive is standard, but all wheel drive is available on all trim levels. Fuel economy ranges from 21 miles per gallon to 27 miles per gallon, and prices start at $33,680 and top out at nearly $50,000 fully equipped. Another Jeep appears on our list at number 3, the Jeep Wrangler. This off-road oriented SUV isn't as refined as many of the other SUVs on this list, but it's spacious, comes standard with all-wheel drive, and is available in two-door and four-door configurations. All this, plus it's roomy. Front headroom comes in at 42.6 inches, while legroom is 41.2 inches. The interior is consistent with what you would expect with an off-road oriented vehicle and isn't necessarily the first vehicle you would think of for a daily driver. The standard engine on the Wrangler is an acceptable 3.6 liter V6 engine paired with a 6-speed manual transmission, but numerous alternative engines are offered along with an optional 8-speed automatic transmission. Fuel economy isn't exciting at 17 to 25 miles per gallon, depending on configuration, but what it lacks in fuel efficiency, it makes up for in performance when on anything other than dry pavement. The Wrangler is available in 11, that's right 11, different models that range from $29,070 for a two-door base sport model to nearly $75,000 for the Rubicon 392. Let's switch gears away from off-road oriented and back into a practical SUV that easily could be a daily driver, the Volkswagen Atlas. The Atlas is a great option for tall people as it provides 41.3 inches of front headroom as well as 41.5 inches of legroom. It's sizable and comes with three rows of seats that are able to seat seven people. The cargo area is an impressive 96.8 cubic feet with the rear seats folded down. The standard 3.6 liter 276 horsepower V6 engine isn't anything extraordinary, but provides adequate acceleration and an overall comfortable ride. Front wheel drive is standard, but all wheel drive is optional. Fuel economy ranges from 17 to 25 miles per gallon, depending on configuration, and prices start at $33,475. We couldn't make a video about SUVs ideal for tall people without talking Chevy Suburban. The Suburban is a monster that is designed to haul people and cargo. Those seated in the front row will enjoy 42.3 inches of headroom and 44.5 inches of legroom. The space in the second row understandably drops, but it's still quite spacious at 38.9 inches of headroom and 42 inches of legroom. The third row naturally shrinks passenger space even further, but is still quite useful at 38.2 inches of headroom and 36.7 inches of legroom. Overall, the Suburban is capable of hauling eight people, or alternatively, up to nearly 145 cubic feet of cargo behind the front seats. The standard engine is a 5.3 liter V8 engine with 10-speed automatic transmission, but multiple other engines are available. The Suburban is available in either two-wheel drive or four-wheel drive and manages fuel economy of between 13 and 20 miles per gallon, depending on configuration. 
The Suburban is available in six iterations throughout General Motors' lineup. A shortened version of the Suburban is available through Chevy as the Chevy Tahoe. Both the Tahoe and the Suburban are available through the GMC nameplate, as well as the Cadillac nameplate as the Cadillac Escalade and Cadillac Escalade ESV. Prices for the Chevy Suburban start at $54,595 and can easily exceed $80,000 fully equipped. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to like the video and subscribe and click the bell for notifications of future videos.